This quaint little village is mile in long. It has some 90 families with around 600 inhabitants. Although it is tiny, the village has made quite an impact on the world. Mile in long has earned the title of being India's, in fact Asia's cleanest village. It is located right here along the Indo-Bangla border in the East Khasi Hills of Meghalaya, approximately 90 km from the capital Shillong. This title was first awarded to them by Discover India magazine in 2003 and then with the Swachh Bharat Abhyan, Prime Minister Modi declared Mile and Long the cleanest village in India and later Asia. The place is definitely one that everyone needs to take inspiration from. Discarded wrappers, plastic bottles and other wastes dawn the Indian streets. They simply are a part of the fabric of our cities and villages. So how does one become a model of cleanliness and sanitation in a country where this has long been a problem? Unlike cities where dwellers are used to getting such services from the municipal bodies, the villagers here own it up completely. In mile and long, cleanliness is not a habit, but rather a long-term tradition. Tidying up is a ritual that everyone from small children to senior citizens take very seriously. Mile and Long has appointed street cleaners who clean the village every day, no matter what the weather conditions are. Even heavy rains don't interfere with the job. Apart from this, villagers engage in community cleaning activities on a regular basis. According to some, the emphasis on cleanliness can be traced back to the late 1800s, when Mile and Long was severely affected by the plague. Others claim it was cholera that hit the village. This was also the time when Christian missionaries from Bangladesh arrived in the village. Slowly, they helped clean up the village and started educating the residents. With education came greater awareness. Today, Mine and Long boasts a literacy rate of close to 100%. Since 2007, each and every house in the village has had functional toilets, putting an end to open defecation. They also have an effective drainage system in place. Traditional bamboo baskets called ko serve as trash cans outside every home and around every lane. Organic trash collected from the village is turned into manure. The use of plastic is limited in my long. What to do with plastic garbage is still a big question. Often the materials are reused and repurposed. Plastic brought by the tourists has to be taken back with them, such as their green awareness that stolen lamps line the village streets. Also, smoking is strictly prohibited here. Tourists are requested to park their vehicle outside the village in a designated parking lot. Those who fail to follow these rules are fined heavily. Clearly, the key to Mile and Long's amazing cleanliness comes from the fact that the onus of keeping the village clean lies with each person residing in the village and the place is rightfully called God's own garden. While India still has a long way to go when it comes to keeping our cities and villages clean, we couldn't have asked for a better role model than Mile and Long. Hello humans, did you know that India is home to the cleanest village of Asia? If you are proud of Mile and Long, then make sure that you share this video with your friends and family. And let us know in the comments which other unique Indian places you would want us to cover next.